Wellspring, thanks for tuning in uh, and while looking at the Wellspring Weekly. Hey, did you get here by tapping the seat? That'd be nifty, because um, you can tap, tap, tap a room. Uh, anyways, I digress. So we are in a series looking at Hebrews chapter 11, and we just did that. We looked at Rahab, and it actually mentions the walls of Jericho uh, as faith. Uh, it's weird. But anyway, so, so we looked at that uh, and looked at the walls of Jericho and Rahab and whatnot and had a moment of looking at like, hey, the deepest thing that I can say today is that, hey, are you a prostitute? Well, there's hope for you in Christ Jesus. That might be the deepest thing that one can say, but it's not the Greek and the Hebrew, right? So anyways, I digress. Uh, but we're, I, I trust and I pray that it was a powerful uh, morning as we unpacked all of this. What was the big thought? Um, the big thought um, was that uh, the glory story is the best story. Um, and so when you and I are seeking after the glory of God, that sets us up for the best type of a story. So here's my challenge to you, which I hope you heard in the sermon, is that you would kind of take a page from, uh, from the text that we looked at and that you would circle, that you would pray around something seven times this week. Is your family struggling? Why not consider walking around your house seven times in prayer? Have you been busting in at work and you don't know what's happening at work or you have an employee or uh, uh, somebody, that, a boss or a coworker that just really annoys you? Well, consider taking a lunch break and walk around your, church, your office building seven times in prayer. Your kid's school, it's about to be school, it's about to go to summer and, and whatnot, so like maybe you need to prayer walk your kid's school seven times as you pray for the summer and for your family. Whatever it might be, uh, I just wanna encourage you um, to trust God in great dependency, as was uh, that dependency was modeled for us, and then go on a prayer walk and uh, seven times around whatever that thing is um, and give it a prayer. All right? Peace.